Hello everyone and welcome to episode 6 of Monster Hunter Freedom Unite. Today, like I said last episode, we're going to be hunting Plesioth and Yang Garuga. So we're not going to be doing any key quests today, but I just wanted to get some new monsters done. Um, and at the end of the episode, um, I'll show my, my original character, because I said I'd be doing that. So that will be at the end of the episode. It'll be time, like time, uh, what's it called? Time stamped, whatever it's called. Um, so you can skip to that if you want, or whatever. But first, we're going to be fighting Plesioth, um, and then after Plesioth, oops, we will be doing um, Yanguruga. Let's get all our items. Okay. Now, someone reminded me about this a couple episodes ago, the fact that you can just jump in here. Let's get that. Now, he'll either be in here or seven. Those are the only two areas he goes to. Okay, so not here. Must be seven. Yep. <laughs> that was a weird camera glitch there. This is a really long cutscene. There we go. Come out, buddy. The only annoying thing is... Oh no, I do have some sonic bombs. I was going to say I don't have any sonic bombs, but I got some supplied. Looks like I don't need them. You don't want to get hit by him when he jumps over in this game, because he puts you to sleep. I don't know why, it's very weird, but he does. Oh no. Okay, good. I thought I was going to bounce everywhere. Hit. Okay, no, I, the hitbox isn't as bad as I thought it was. Oh, there we go. <laughs> There's the terrible hitbox. Why are you yelling back in the water, bro? He's gonna do a jet. These Apsaros is constantly following me. Come on, get out of the water. Now I'm just going to Sonic Bomb you then. Oh, of course. Ah, yeah, there we go, he's out anyway. They should bring back Plesioth, he's a cool giant fish. Hit. This is going to be a hip check here. Oh, it's not. Okay. Can you not? I'm going to die if he does a hip check. Oh god. <laughs> that Aptros probably could have killed me there. Oh, he's angry. Use my singular mega potion. Hip check. Yep, already knew it. Hip check. Yep. Damn it. Oh, these Apsaros go away. They're so annoying. Can you just leave me alone, buddy? Why are you, you're taking up my whole screen? Jesus. <laughs> oh, that was close. Huh. Oh. Why did I subject myself to fighting a Plesioth? Like, I did this willingly. Oh, 
I swear he's, he's got like three moves and his hip check move has like a 30% probability of being used. It's so annoying. He's going to do hip check right now. Yep, told you. That was close. Actually, this is a painful episode in general because I got Yangaruga afterwards as well, which isn't terrible, but it is one of the uh, more annoying monsters. I just really want to fight um, Hypnoctris. I love Hypnoctris so much. I can't remember if there's a, um, a village Hypnoctris or not. Obviously, there's a guild one, but I'm not sure about village. I think there might be, but I'm not certain. Hit check. Yeah, I knew it. There goes 80% of my health. I actually don't know if I'm going to have enough potions. Unless he dies relatively easily, but like... Each hip check takes like 2-3 to three potions to heal. Oh, he's leaving. I think. Yeah. I wish you could swim, like in 3U. As much as I hate the controls, it would be good. Okay. So, he'll be in here. Yep. <laughs> Gee, that was uh, quite a powerful jump. I forgot you can't do uh, aerial attacks. I tried to hit him there, <laughs> in the air. Can you not? Oh my god, really? So th there's another three potions gone right there. I'm just going to have to use one and hope he doesn't hit me again, which he will. Because I only have four potions left. I got some herbs, but you know, I'm, I'm hit. Oh my god, bro. Can you not? God. Oh my god. Everything in the old gen just wants to murder you. You, you get no assistance. Oh, finally. Even though, yeah, his uh, knock over there isn't very long. He just flops around a couple times. Hip check, I already know it. Yep, I'm hit. Oh. He just spams it. I'm just gonna die. I don't care right now. Because I, I just don't have potions. So I'm just gonna... <laughs> I gotta use up my life. Oh, I don't want to die to that. How about we use some herbs? Just to get my health up a bit. Is he leaving again? Oh no, he's just going around like a crazy fish. Now I need to sharpen, but... You can't cancel sharpen, so I'm just going to have to risk it. Oh, okay, damn it. No, that's fine. I thought he was um, doing the laser. That was with, like the water jet. <laughs> that would have been annoying. Oh my god, these Vespoids is constantly coming around. <laughs> Nice. Didn't get many hits in, but better than nothing. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm... That was very close, because we, we were almost out of potions. We only had two left, I think it was. Okay. Now, I'm, I was... I can't remember which... Where was Yangaruga? I think it was four star. Oh, there's a green Plesios as well. Yep. Kishala de Aura. Wow. Elder already. Yeah, Cuckoo. Monobloss. Oh. Maybe there isn't a Yangaruga. I swear I saw a Yangaruga. I must have looked at this one and thought it said Yangaruga. Oh. Okay. Unless it's like one of those quests that come and go. Um, well, we're going to do Monobloss then. Because that's one of the key quests we have to do. Um, 
I kind of want at least one Psycho Serum. So then, like, if I forget to paintball, I can still find him. Okay. Oh, I don't have any Megas, though. This is... I need honey. I don't have honey. How much is it to unlock the honey thing? I know I can do, um, like, why there, why, why even, oh, um, the eggs and, um, uh, what's it called? And powder stone deliveries to get more stuff. I just haven't gone around to doing that yet. So I will do that at some point. Um, because how many points was it to upgrade? 3,000 points. That's, that's exactly the amount of points you get from one powder stone. So I might actually have to do that. Okay. I've seen it. Let me harvest it, please. How much honey do you get? Like, two or three? One. <laughs> okay, it's uh, less than I thought. So I'm not going to bother making a mega yet, then. That's the only, that's the one thing I do like about the new farm, um, may as well eat, um, the fact that you can get heaps of the one item, not just, you know, check, well I mean you can check at each quest, but still. Okay, let's go, something I think would taste nice, juicy rib roast and tasty rice. Yeah, I got nothing from it. Let's go. Let's get this quest. Uh, Mother boss. I don't know how this is going to go. I really don't. <laughs> do I even have... Okay, good, it's night time. I was going to say, do I even have cold drinks? I do anyway. But you need um hot drinks in the desert at night. Okay, let's have some rations. Get our stamina up to max. And then, is there a balloon out? That would be easier. I can't see. What was that flash? But it doesn't look like there's a balloon out. But yeah, that was a flash there. I don't know what that was. It made me think of um, Valstrax. Because like how Valstrax is in the sky in um, GU. I'm just going to take the Psycho Serum now to see where the uh, cutscene starts. Seven, okay. See, I would have gone all the way over to like five and then all the way through, like it would have taken ages. Get away from these cephalos. I don't know how this monobloss is going to go. I like monobloss, but it's also an annoying monster because it's, it's just a one horned diabloss. That you can only hunt single player. But they should really bring back Monobloss. Like, he hasn't been. I actually don't know what the last game Monobloss was in. Um, I don't know if it was, like, this old gen or if he's been in fourth gen. I'm not sure. I might have to look that up if I remember. Did he just leave, really? Are you serious? Did he actually just leave? That is so annoying. Oh no. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, come on. I managed to stop his roar. <laughs> of course, he does hip checks as well, because why wouldn't he? And what am I gonna be able to hit on him? Nothing? Okay, I can hit his little, his little legs. Actually, he's got quite big calves. Try and get that tail off as well, if possible. I was hoping it would get stuck in there. I know they can get stuck in certain locations, I don't know where. But some of the rocks they can get stuck in. Really? I remember the, um, in the pot, so like the, um, pretty much G rank of, uh, of village, basically. Um, doing the, what's it, I think it's white monobloss and normal monobloss quest. That's such a pain. 
Where is he coming up? Right there. Try and get this tail off. At least I can... Oh, that was really easy to get off. That that shows that he doesn't have much health then. That that definitely shows he does not have much health. His tails are kind of indicative of like the main monster's health. It's like the tail to cut off is like a certain percent of the monster's health on the tail. Like they have their own cut threshold, but like there's a certain amount that you have to do. And usually it doesn't take what is that like six, seven hits to cut off. Is he angry? No, okay. I was gonna say I love it when, when I love the look of the like the face when they're angry. Oh damn it. Getting affected by the raw late is basically a death sentence. As you can see, that was incredibly close. Okay, gotta get that tail. Oh, I guess I can just leave it. Can this Cephalos please go away? Roll. Okay, good. Le you have to leave it pretty late <laughs> if you got, if you got your weapon out. I won't get hit much. Yep, I already knew that. Oh. What a waste! Of, well, it's not really a waste of the Sonic Bomb, is it then? Because I can't hit him anyway. Oh my God, Cephalos! Please go away. No one likes you. there, sir. Or madam. I don't know. Come on, bro. Jeez. That was very close. Oh, of course, you're doing a tail. And now you're going to do a hip check. No, nope, tail swing. I'm surprised we haven't fought like a Rathian or Rathalos yet, now that I just thought about that. God, my camera forcefully turned when I went to that rock. I have a herb so I don't use the first aid med. But yeah, I, I would have I guess um, if I was doing guild I probably would have fought one already. They probably have them earlier than things like Diablos. Because you can't fight non-boss in guild because it's um... There's some kind of law constraints where one boss can only be four single player. I can't remember the exact law behind it. Okay, now he's angry. We have the cool face and look now. See how he's got like, oh, well, I'm basically dead. The uh, red stripes. If possible, I would like to just go to base camp and not use any healing items. So I can just sleep on the bed, get a full heal instead of having to use a first aid med and like two or three potions. That trigger zone was really far into the, the transition. Okay, let's get this going. Make it nice and fast. So we didn't have to use any potions, which is good. And let's go back and fight ourselves Monoblos. And he's not angry anymore. Let's go, buddy. Oh, stupid bouncing. <laughs> it's going to get me hit at some point. He's going to do a bite. Yep. You can tell by um, the tail, by the way with monsters like this, when their tail, when they turn and their tail kind of flops a bit, they usually run. Um, but when they turn, if their tail stays stiff, it usually means they're going to do a fire attack, or in Rathalos's case, it usually means he's going to do a fireball. Rathalos and Rathian. I'll have to show you an example of what I mean. 
Because, like, there is a difference. It's really subtle. But when they're... When they turn, like... Okay, let me see if he turns here. Let's see what he does. So, see how his tail flopped? He's gonna run. See? Because when he turned, his tail flopped slightly. Let's see if he does a stiff tail turn. That's That one's flop. I really want to show this. It's not It's not 100% foolproof. He's gonna run again. Yep. You can just tell by the tail. I remember noticing this when I was like 10. There we go, stiff tail. So he's gonna bite or something. Yep. See? Hopefully you guys saw what I meant there with the tail. I'm um, hit. Oh no, surprise. This is a little tip that most people don't notice, to be honest, with the tails. Um, usually the only monsters I've seen at work with is um, Monobloss, Diabloss, Rathalos, Rathian, those type of monsters. Whatever they are. Flying white and stuff, I guess, I don't know. And it's only it's only the case in these older games. I think G use is still like that slightly. Um, but things like World Rise, it's it, that doesn't count anymore. From what I've noticed, I haven't I haven't actually paid enough attention, but I don't think so. I'm hit. I mean, luckily, Monoboss takes forever to come up. Like Diabolos, he would have come up and just hit me immediately. I was tempted to use that Sonic bomb, but I won't. Let's see what he does here with the tail. Let's look. See, flop tail. He's gonna run. Okay. Yeah, there we go. He did an extra turn there. Though. <laughs> Hopefully, you guys know what I see. What I'm talking about now. This is so random. Like, I don't know why I noticed it when I did, but I just did. Warming effect. Let's hope you don't go for me. this herb as well. He's not very good underground, is he? Things on a run. Or oh, dig, okay. So with the flop tail he can also dig, I guess. <laughs> he shouldn't have been sitting there. Okay. Now I need to sharpen. Could risk it right now. There we go. Let's do it now. Okay, so he's back to seven. But yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know why. I just, I remember telling my brother and my friend about it, um, how you could like tell the difference between the tail back when I was 10, 11, around there. Um, I don't think they ever really noticed it, to be honest, and they couldn't really tell the difference. I'm sure they could, but I don't remember. It's been such a long time. Um, so I don't know if what made me notice it, but I just did. I am always paying attention to the small details, so that could be why. Anyway. Oh, he's having a little yawn. Is she you tired? I'm very glad that didn't hit me. I just decided to stay still. Let me get a paintball going. Okay, he's on the ground. Let's use this, why not? I'll also get rid of that Cephalos out of here. I know I can't actually hit him, but we'll just bounce, that's fine. I had to dodge that Cephalos. Uh, sand ball? Sand projectile? I don't know what you'll call it, to be honest. That was close. Almost roared. Do the roar. Angry. Let's see if we can get some damage in before he attacks me. Okay, flop tail. Okay, so he can do a hip check on the flop tail as well. It's usually from what I've, from what I've seen, most of the time, you can most of the time when the t the tail is stiff, it's more attacks that you can hit him on, and especially with Rathian and Rathalos, because they, especially with them, because like they do that insta sprint. Where, like they'll just sprint instantly so if you see the tail flop you know not to be in front of them but if it's stiff then you know you can probably be in front of them because they're, they're going to do a fireball surely Rathalos Rathian isn't that far off so I'll be able to show you guys an example soon get this health up 
I'm, I'm, I'm excited. Um, for people that haven't watched, that don't watch the World Series or don't watch it all the way through, um, I'm going to be doing an Easter special video. Just to, guys, to let you all know, um, I'm going to be playing, I'm going to be hunting a Legombi, because you know, Easter rabbits. Um, hunting a Legombi in Portable 3rd, GU, and Rise. Um, and then just putting that into a video. Like, it's not going to be something super special, it's just murdering rabbits, basically. But I thought I'd mention it on this series as well. Um, that will be coming out whenever Easter is. I can't... There's, there's too many days for Easter. I don't know which day it is. Which one the actual Easter day is. I haven't looked it up yet. Um, but I'm obviously in Australian time zone, so if you're in America, it'll be coming out the day before, probably. So my demographic is usually American, Australian, Japanese. So for Japanese people, um, well, your time zone is pretty much the exact same as mine, so that's fine. Oh, he's staring right at me. Oh, damn it. I, I was running at him to, like, you know, dodge him at the last second. That was a terrible idea. <laughs> now I've got, like, no health left, and if he comes out, I'm dead, and it's all my fault. Okay, we're good. Hopefully. And there's black cats here. I never remember their actual name. Mel something or Mel... Mel... I can't remember. I'm not being racist by saying black cats, I just can't remember their name. I can't remember the name of the other one either, they're just... I just know them as white cats. <laughs> Dead. Luckily he went for the cat. Oh, really? You stole my map, really, man? Luckily I got it back. <laughs> I mean, I know this map, like this uh, zone well enough, but still. Why do you go for the map? He's gonna run at me. I'm dead. Okay, no. Can you get that healing going? Yeah. There is an opportunity. Okay, good. He's not angry anymore. Do the damage. I don't feel like I've done that much damage on him yet, to be honest. Like, I feel like I've been missing a lot of opportunities. Risk. Almost didn't pay off. <laughs> Can you stop with the tail swipes, please? Ooh, a Vespoid. You're knocked on the ground. That's not rare, but harder to happen than usual. Uh, I want it. He's going to despawn before I can get it. Come on, Monobolos, go somewhere else. Cat, stop following me. Oh, he actually did go somewhere else. There we go. I swear, this guy spends half the fight just sitting underground doing nothing. Ah, yeah. oh, fuck. Sharpen, we got hit. Oh, everything. Oh, good. He's limping. Okay. We'll do a full sprint. Die. Oh, that bounce might have actually saved me there. Can you stop just sprinting? going in here. <laughs> Saving myself. 
Even though I bet he's gonna pop up the second I come back through, like right on top of me. Kinda of Superman in case, I wasn't sure. He's gonna run again. Okay, he's gonna die in three more hits. I really don't like him just constantly going underground. I don't remember Monobloss doing this, but to be fair, I haven't fought a Monobloss for going on 10 years, probably. This might actually be my first Monobloss in like 10 years. That's kind of crazy to think, if, it, if that is the case. And this gen prey just doesn't want to give up. Came off. Glass is fine. And dead. And dead. And dead. And dead. And dead. 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 Don't go for me. Oh, he went for the gen prey. Well, actually, for the cat, obviously, but he hit the gen prey. Good. Gen prey deserves it. He's gonna run again. He just constantly sprints. He's gonna run again. He's gonna run again. He's gonna run again. I just gotta get some hits in there. We go finally. I don't know why I rolled there. I wasn't even near. There we go. Finally. Mono blocks down. I like their head more than um, Diablos as well, like not just the, the horn, but like the crown bit they have, just like, it kind of looks like a bird, the beak as well. Let's check to see if there's any weapons and armor, I can't remember. Long sword, so no, nothing that I can create, but there might be something to improve, I don't know. And Monobloss, 36, wow, that's nice. As you can see, we got an insane amount of shells for some reason, that quest. Okay, that's all good. Let's restock. Oops, no, I do not want to buy worms. Okay. Okay, yep, so we haven't finished all the key quests yet, but that's fine. Okay, so now what I'm going to do... Actually, I'll quickly go do the farm first. Um, but I'm going to go into my other character, just to show you guys my character. I mean, there's, it's not that special. But still, I feel like it could be cool to, you know, to see my very old original character. Um, I will be doxing my real name though because I made it when I was 10, so I made, I, I used my real name when I made it. So I'll see you guys on that character. Okay, so here we are. This is my original, very first character I ever made. Um, in Monster Hunter in general, but Monster Hunter Freedom Night specifically. As you can see, I have doxed my name, that is okay. I've got Geodrome Claws on me for some reason. Um, but let's have a look at my guild card. So I've got all you can lost gear. Um, I don't know if that's good, but I just made it because I thought it looked cool. Um, when you fly the unicorn follows, I don't know. I was 12 maybe at this point, 13, somewhere around there. Um, I've done a lot of quests as you can see. Um, I am, I am a very, very big longsword main on my main character, as uh, you can see, 1,258 quests. Um, that was just some quests that I've done recently. Um, 2016 is the oldest one you can see on here. 
uh, Jin Chan, my favorite cat. That's, um, actually I'll show you him in a second. That's the cat that I'm using as my profile picture on YouTube. I got every single treasure. Those were a pain to get, but I did it. Um, now I don't have every reward. I never, award, I never did this. Um, I mean, I've got some of them, but not all of them. Because I was never able to kill this one here, this Crimson Patellus, that one's White Patellus G rank. I was never able to do those two. Um, I might eventually do it. Um, and then here's my hunts. I never got all the crowns. I was, didn't care about crowns at this point. Um, so here's all the monsters I hunted over the years. Well, most of them. Not everything shows in this guild card. And this is the bit I'm most proud of. I don't know why. Yankuku training? 50 seconds. I, could ne I never found anyone that could beat that time, I'm pretty sure. And that's all, that's legit. Um, and I've got a bunch of people on here, friends and random people I played with years ago. If, if Leo or Jeremy is out there somewhere, I remember playing with you guys, 2011. I think it was Leo that was insane, yeah. Leo has an insane guild card. <laughs> um, yeah, so let's have a look. So I've done all those. I've done every quest besides one, I think, for Nakot. Yeah. It's just this one, Rathos, Tigrex, Nug, Cougar, Rajang, I haven't done. I just realized how much money this character has, holy. Um, where's the money gone? 1,146,393. Um, so then here, I've done all those quests. Done all those. And I think I've done up to G1. Yeah, I've done G1. I haven't done G2 yet, because I've just got some quests to do. I gotta do G9 as well, which I haven't fully done. I'll be finished you can last in that. Um uh, reference monster list. Yeah, so I've killed five Fatalis. Those are all standard Fatalis, I'm pretty sure. I did that myself. Um I was mad I was able to solo normal Fatalis in this game. I used their sword and shield. It was the only weapon I could kill him with. 21 Yamaskami, because I love Yamaskami. Eight layer Shanlong. I think those are the only ones that don't show on the guild card. Um, and I'll show you Jin Cham now. Feline Kitchen. Here he is. Jin Cham. The guy that's the, the cat that's on my um as my profile picture on YouTube. That's the that's the man. That's the real one right now. <laughs> um, let me check my items. I feel like my box is real full. I can't remember though. Let me put these geodrome claws away. What have we got? So we got eight pages worth. Four you can lost stones. I got a lot of stuff. Um, yeah, I, I don't really know what else to show on this character. I think that's about it, to be honest. Um, oh yeah, those are my skills. Um, quick eating is amazing. ESP is amazing. I've got demonic protection, unfortunately, but that's just what happens. Um, yeah, so that's about everything. So if you want to see anything else in this character, let me know. I'm just not sure what else to show. But yeah, so I'm going to end this episode here. Hopefully you guys all enjoyed, and there will be another episode on Saturday, and then there will be the Easter special sometime soon. So I'll see you on the next one. Bye.